Hey guys, Antonalog here, and what I really like about Android is that you can change your entire setup and customize it to make it your own, so today I'll be showing you guys what's on my Android setup. Alright, so currently I'm using the Moto Z, it's a great phone and I'll have coverage of it in the future. Alright, so diving in at the top you can see I have a Zuper widget. If you don't know what Zuper widget is, it's basically where you can customize and make your own widgets and you can also download skins to skin your widgets. This one is the Parrot skin, I pretty much just downloaded it and stuck it on. It's a great skin and I'll leave the link in the description for all the apps that I mentioned in this video. So moving down you can see um, the bottom two rows, they're actually the Moonshine Icon Pack. I really like it, it's flat, minimalistic, and it goes with my overall theme, so that's what I'm using right now. And the bottom two rows are pretty much all my essential apps, Instagram, Twitter, Snapchat. Um, be sure to follow me there for all the behind the scenes on these videos. It's what I use on a daily basis. Um, so yeah, and also I have the bottom row, which is pretty much um, just the essentials that I use all the time. Um, swiping to the right, you can see I have the month calendar widget. It's a great calendar widget, um, very minimal. That's the kind of the theme that I'm going for here. And I know a lot of people have it, but there's a reason for that and it's just because it's a great widget. Um, down below, Wells Fargo, obviously managing my finances. Panasonic image app, it's what I use to the connect to the camera over there. Um, Slice, Slice is a very nice package tracker. You can see that I have different packages that I've tracked. For example, a Motorola Moto 360, um, stuff like that. It's a nice package tracker, and it's what I use to make sure packages don't go missing. Um, Google Play Store, YouTube um, Creator Studio, great app. It allows me to reply to comments, check my statistics on the videos. So again, something I use a lot, um, every day, pretty much. Then I have the Amazon Underground App Store, and it's one of my favorite apps on this phone, and huge shout out to Amazon for sponsoring this video. So the Amazon Underground App Store basically allows you to get paid apps on the Google Play Store, but you can get them for free on the Underground App Store. All right, so for example, let's say I want to get Dr. Panda's Restaurant because I love Panda Express. All right, so this, this game is usually, let's see, $2.99 on the Google Play Store, but now it's completely free because I can just download it from the Amazon Underground App Store. Also for the apps that are actually paid, you can see we can have Amazon Coins. And this is basically Amazon's virtual currency. It allows you to save from 5 to 25% in savings. So if you're a big spender, you like to spend lots of money on apps, this will definitely help you out, save you quite a bit of money. All right, so other than that, I have b &H. I also have Visco. Visco is what I use to color grade all my photos. So for example, this is an Instagram photo that I recently posted. I'm, I'm really liking the A series filters. They're really nice and mellow and they're not too contrasty. Sometimes I use the C filters, but I really like Visco and that's pretty much what I use for all my Instagram photos. Other than that, there's Chrome and Google Play Music. It's very simple, nothing too special about it. And yeah, that's pretty much all that's on my phone. All right, so another app I want to cover is Hexlock, and it allows me to cover up any app that I don't want people seeing. So for example, if I don't want people snooping through my Instagram, I'll tap on Instagram, and I'll have to enter a pin or my fingerprint in so that I can access the, the app. That's pretty much all there is to Hexlock. It's a super useful app that I use all the time, but I don't really mess around with it much, so you don't see it. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it. So for my app drawer, I just have pretty basic stuff, you know, AdWords, Kruma Keyboard, it's a really nice keyboard app that changes the color of your keyboard. Europa and Fox are both Zuper widget skins. Um, obviously Hexlock. Uh, that's pretty much it, to be honest. I mean, there's not really a lot that's not on my home screen that I use really often, because I like to keep everything that I use pretty much on my home screen, so I never have to open up the app drawer. But that's pretty much it. Thanks so much for watching. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up. If you disliked it, tell me why in the comments below. And also comment what your Android setup is like. Anyways guys, thanks so much for watching and I'll catch you guys in the next video.